how to pair a Pixie multifunction controller to scenes. Pixie Smart Home System allows you to create scenes with Pixie or Pixie Plus apps and then pair these scenes to a button on the wall using the Pixie multifunction controllers. One or more Pixie scenes need to be created before pairing these scenes with the Pixie multifunction controller installed on the wall. First, create the scenes. We are assuming you have all of your Pixie devices added into the Pixie app before starting this process. Step one is to create the scenes in the Pixie app of your choice that you would like to pair to your on-wall multifunction controllers. Head to the scene section in your Pixie app of choice. We're using the Pixie Plus app in this example. Press the three little dots in the top right hand corner, select add, provide a name and select an icon for the scene, And now choose which devices or groups to include and be sure to set the state for each item for this scene. For example, if you're creating a goodbye scene, your state might be off for all devices. But if you're creating a welcome home scene, your state for each of the devices you choose to include in your scene would be different. Save your scene. Now repeat this process to create the scenes that you need. Before we move on, test the scenes to make sure you are happy with the outcome. Remember, you can edit these scenes at any time by pressing the three little dots and selecting Edit. Also remember, scenes do not toggle on and off. They recall a specific state for the device, on, off, dimmed, etc., according to what you choose in the scene creation process. Pressing the scene button again and again will simply recall that same scene again and again, which means you may have to turn all of your lights off and recall the scene again to be sure it's working as expected. An easy way to do this is to use the built-in all off scene and then press your newly created scene again to test it. Next, we're going to pair these scenes to the multifunction controllers of your choice. First, make sure you're physically close to your multifunction controller. Ideally, you would be able to hold your mobile device right next to it. In the app, from the scenes section, press the three little dots and select pairing. From this list, choose the first option. SMF BTAS. This is the part number of the Pixie multifunction controller. You will notice you can have single click and or double click options. This means you can have just a single click action, you can have just a double click action, or you can have both a single click and double click actions. To set this up, simply press select a scene button next to the desired function, press the circle next to the scene you wish to pair with this click and choose next. When you're done, press the Confirm and Start Pairing button at the bottom of the page. You will be instructed to press the Pixie Multifunction button four times before the 30 second timeout completes. You want to press this four times within about one to two seconds. Follow the instructions on screen in the app and let the app finish pairing process completely before you operate the multifunction controller on the wall. You can pair your scenes to a number of multifunction controllers throughout your home as you need. Now, test it from the wall. If the scene is not quite right, head back to the scene section. Edit your scene and repair following the same process. If you're thinking of installing a lot of Pixie multifunction controllers in one location, you may be better off using the Pixie Touch Panel. The Pixie Touch Panel provides you access to all of your scenes and everything else in your home, as well as including individual devices, groups, rooms, and so on. And of course, you can always use the Pixie apps to recall the scenes, and with Pixie Plus and Voice Control activated, you can use your voice to recall these scenes too.